Six months ago, I had the brilliant idea to rewrite my tune. This seemed like a good idea at the time, you know, I was bored of my appearance, whatever, but it turned out that taking what was a pretty good look and converting it into this 20 feet tall blueberry looking fucker was not a good idea. So, as of today, I have reverted back to my original appearance, which was much better and I really liked. So, now nobody can be fucking sad when they look at my tune and realize how fucking ugly it is. And we're back to actually having my tune match my profile picture and appearance. That's about it. And so I'm going to now talk about a few other things if you care to stick around. As of today, I have moved back into my college dorm, so I am no longer living with my parents like I did for the summer, and I'm back at the University of California, Berkeley, a place where depression and sorrow becomes personified. No longer just an emotion, now it's a living human being that you interact with on a daily basis. Some pretty unique stuff. So... Anyhow, essentially, now I'm going to be going to class, studying, you know, stressing, feeling like the world's over when I get a bad grade on a test, all that fun stuff. That will now be another major part of my life once again. And for those of you who missed me last year, you'll probably get to see a bunch of videos where I'm stressed the fuck out. So that is another great thing to look forward to. And so, it, it's a really nice room, though, I gotta say, honestly. It has a really nice internet connection. It took me like two seconds to get it work to get my internet set up, and I was worried for a second it wasn't going to work, but it's actually a really fucking amazing Ethernet connection. And I just have tons of storage space, a really nice just setup and layout. It really feels like a very nice quality place to live. Probably helps that this dorm is like two years old, and the one I was in before was like a hundred fucking years old, not even joking. And it's just a really nice area, nice common rooms, everything. I've got a great roommate, one of my good friends, who's a bit of a partier's next door, so I get to have fun with him but I don't have to, like, have the party in my place. So all those are going to be great things to look forward to, and I'm pretty excited. And I've got a cool schedule. I've got an intro comp sci course. Well, intro in the sense that, like, it's the intro course if you're declaring the major. I've still have done a lot of coding experience, like I did my internship this summer. Got great reviews from my people, good evaluation and recommendations. So that was pretty successful, and I'm hoping my classes go well this year. Got some comp sci, some math all that fun stuff, and then I got a data science connector course and something about Near Eastern studies so I can get a little bit cultured on the Middle East, which will be just interesting from my own perspective. And the guy teaching it's an atheist. He's, like, completely non-biased, and it's, it's going to be an interesting course for sure. And I'm looking forward to it. So that's probably about it on my living situation and all that. Just wanted to brief you guys on that if you decide to care. If you don't, I'm sorry you sat through this, like, two-minute thing. My apologies for wasting your life. So just a few more words I wanted to say about what's going to happen into the future with the channel and what my plans are for streaming, for videos, for scheduling, all that. I definitely do want to make sure that I can continue doing this channel into the future. And part of that is going to be managing my time, spacing it out well, not burning through all my ideas at once, and also just not burning myself out through like a grind of making videos. So I'm going to be very mindfully spacing out trying to make a video or two a week. Probably going to try to stop doing more than two videos a week once I get situated into my classes. I start classes this Wednesday. So the pace will be a little slower than what I was doing two weeks ago, but that is going to be so it is easy for me to sustain and I make sure I don't burn out or get really far behind on my school or anything like that. Something that I can actually commit to doing. And I also want to stream at least two days a week too. So I want to stream twice a week and do two videos a week is going to be my goal. I might have to get it down to one stream a week or one video a week if I actually start finding the schoolwork really challenging or I'm having a really tough time keeping up. But those are my, my initial goals. And I need to actually step back and think about what schedule is going to work best for me. I need to take a couple days to do that, so I don't want to commit to any of you for a schedule. But I'm going to release a video just basically talking about my streaming and upload schedule for those that care. And I'll make sure I commit to it. Also, I do plan on moving my streaming to Twitch. And the reason for this is... There's a couple reasons. First of all, it's just really hard to moderate a YouTube chat because lots of random people come in and just do crazy stuff. Also, I think that Twitch just has way better future features for a user. It's way easier to actually use the emotes to, you know, talk to viewers and have fun with that. It's easier for me to give people emotes like a sub emote if they're interested in that. Now, I'd have to actually become a Twitch affiliate, which would take like a month because I have no streams on there ever set up, but... After streaming on Twitch for about a month, I'll get an affiliate thing, so that'll be a thing. Don't expect tons of people to sub, but I'll just have it available if anyone decides to. Also, I just think Twitch is a much nicer service. 
with a nice polished outlook, anything like that. I'm going to link my Twitch TV in this description so you guys can follow me if you're interested. Um, because I'm going to be streaming there, and I know some of you have only been watching my YouTube content, so I figure it would make sense to connect those two platforms. But And I also made a poll on my Discord, and almost the overwhelming majority of you said you would prefer streams on Twitch to those on YouTube, for many of the reasons I listed before. Also, I could get hosted by other people once in a while if they wanted to help me out, and they just happened to be done. I don't expect that to be a common thing, because I'm probably going to be ending my streams like earlier than some of the other people are, but just... I don't know. I think overall, just for a lot of reasons, it'll be a good platform. It was nice to have that exclusivity on YouTube, but I also just found that I got crazy growth those first few times, but it's just not a consistent thing. Like, YouTube just seems so all over the place, and there was also just issues with the chat. So, yeah, we are going to move, we are going to be moving to Twitch. Link is in the description. Streaming schedule will come out in entirety very soon. So those are all things to look forward to in the future. And yeah, just in general, I'm glad to be back in Berkeley. Just got situated, like my area. Gonna go eat some great food and watch some LCS playoffs today. Take it easy. And I think it will be a good experience for everyone. Thank you all for watching this little video. I know you probably weren't expecting this much random shit about my life when you clicked on a video. Just about my tune rewrite, but at least I segregated it pretty well. So it was pretty obvious when that part was done. As always... Much appreciated, and thanks to all my subscribers for always being here, having my back. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.